Hi guys, today in this video, I will be making a simple and powerful portable spot welder with automatic output sensing that automatically welds without pressing any button. For this, I designed the simple circuit diagram in which I used 8 pieces of logic gate MOSFETs for high current and fast switching. Also, I used gate driver IC that will receive switching pulse from this 80 tiny 13 controller IC. Also, I used buzzer for pulse indication. And the best part, here this octocoupler will sense if probes are touched on nickel strip, then this controller sends milliseconds pulse through this gate driver to trigger the MOSFETs for welding short. And this welder can be directly operated from 12 volt power source. For easy assembly, I converted the schematics into the PCB layout. And the PCB is going to be look like this. You can download both circuit diagram and PCB files, link is in video description. In order to manufacture this PCB, visit jlcpcb.com. And here you can add the Gerber file I provided. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and the color of PCBs as per your requirements. And then save to cart for checkout. Within some days I got my order from JLCPCB delivered. And the quality of the PCBs is amazing, and 5 pieces is for just $2. And now it is time to assemble the PCB. So, let's place all the components on the PCB according to the circuit diagram. And after spending some time with the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl alcohol. And here our PCB is looking nice and clean. Now pre-solder all the MOSFET pads. I used IRLB4132 high current logic gate MOSFETs. Trim the middle pin of MOSFETs since it is internally connected with the MOSFET body. Now solder all the MOSFETs at its places. Use a copper wire to make PCB traces for high current tolerance. And do a thick layer of soldering on source and drain pins of all MOSFETs. Now pre-solder this pad, and use LM7805 voltage regulator, and install this 5 volt regulator at its place. You can use 3 mm nut bolts to secure all the MOSFETs at its place. Take TLP250 IC and install in its IC base. Now before installing AT Tiny 13 IC, connect it with Arduino as shown in diagram. Open the Arduino IDE on your computer and click on Boards Manager and search MicroCore. You will see MicroCore by MCU Dude. Click to install this library. Open the Arduino ISP from example codes and upload this to your Arduino. Then open the spot welder code and select AT Tiny 13 from Boards Manager. Also select Arduino as ISP, then click to upload the code. Then install the IC at its place. I used 6 mm of copper cable for welding probes and used 1 mm of enamel copper wire 
for making probe tips and added 8 mm thimbles to another end. For battery I used same 6 mm cable and added alligator clips and 8 mm thimbles. Now it is time to connect cables with this PCB. Connect battery positive and welding probes positive here and secure with the nut bolt. And connect welding probes negative over here. Connect battery negative here. I used 12 volt car battery as power source. You'll hear one beep when it is connected with battery. As you can see the welder is able to sense when probes are touched and sends a current shot for welding. And currently pulse timing is 20 milliseconds and for thick strips you can increase timing in code. Now let's test the welder on a lithium battery. Now place the nickel strip and touch the both probes you will hear a beep and then welds automatically. Also welding spots are strong enough and cannot break easily. Now let's do another test. As you can see, it works awesome and works same as commercial spot welders. So, if you enjoyed the video give a thumbs up. For more useful videos, subscribe the channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.